some driving living or some driving living in the Fort uh, drivers living in the Fort Mill area. I should say seeing double. Look at this. The signs along streets and highways side by side appearing to be identical and it has some drivers questioning the way their tax money is being spent. NBC Charlotte's Billie Jean Shaw has been talking to SCDOT about those duplicate signs. She's in York County tonight with more on what she's learned. Yeah, the double signs you're seeing are only temporary. SCDOT says they're replacing the old signs with new ones all in the name of safety. They want drivers to make sure that they can see the road signs when they're traveling down the highway at nighttime, especially in such a crowded area like Highway 160. Signs of growth through York County are evident in the roadways. The town of Fort Mill is going through a huge growth spurt as SCDOT estimates a total of 21,000 cars travel down Highway 160 every day. Due to the amount of traffic, NBC Charlotte has learned I-77 and several highways in the county, including 160, are undergoing a facelift as SCDOT is installing new and improved signs in the area. Some drivers don't agree with the move, expressing their frustration on social media, calling the idea a waste of money due to two signs being in the same area. We spoke to SCDOT by phone sharing this concern. A spokesman for the York County area says the old signs will eventually be removed and are being replaced to improve the safety of all drivers as traffic continues to grow in the area. We're told the new signs are meant to upgrade visibility. As you can see, they are much taller than the old ones, and according According to officials, the reflective quality is much better to make sure drivers can see the signs at night. And tonight, SEDOT says they want taxpayers to know they're not wasting their money. They say once they're done with the old signs, they're going to recycle them, upgrade them, and put them back on the roadways. Reporting in York County, Billie Jean Shaw, NBC Charlotte.